Hello again everybody. Um, I just thought I'd uh, show you tonight. I was looking at the uh, test tube colonies um, and um, this is Queen D um, and unfortunately I still can't see any eggs with Queen D. Um, as I'll explain in a minute and you'll see I've got some exciting news to come at the end but every other Queen has laid eggs so far but not Queen D. But what we have got is a brand new callow um, and this is obviously the first callow of the new season so we've got a new worker and with the joys of having um, YouTube actually recording because I, I, whenever something happens I record it for everyone and normally I do a quick commentary over the top and upload it the same night. So I know that I did that video where I said first pupa of the new season was on the 1st of March. And here we are now, we're on the 28th of March. So it's taken 28 days, which is four weeks for that um, pupa to develop. Um, here, actually, in the corner, you can see the broken open pupa case that she's come out of. But yeah, it's taken four weeks because the front room drops down to less than 20 degrees overnight. Sometimes I come in in the morning and it's 17 or 18 degrees. So because the temperature is going to less than 20 for some of the time, it's extended the time it takes as pupa. Um, then I got fixated, actually, on this larvae who's uh, uh, in the middle of eating a little bit of... Um, uh, gnat, I think it is. It's um, those things that fly over. There's a bridge actually on the way home where I walk and um, you get those little clouds of gnats flying over it and I clap them and put them in a little pot and bring them home. Um, you have to be hard uh, and stick to your guns in larvae world because workers keep relocating bits of it all over the place. See that one managed to cling on and hold on to their dinner when it was about to be taken off them. Um, but then yet yeah, the other good news is that that strange queen that I had that only ever had six workers, um, a little bit of bad news is that two of her workers have died. Um, but she stopped laying any eggs in about June and she just sat there with six workers doing nothing until hibernation. She has now laid a little patch of eggs um, and looks set to start going for the new season. So I'm really pleased about that. She's got four workers and some eggs. Anyway, until next time, thank you for watching. Goodbye, everyone.